What is Slake YouTube? This is Juan from the Gamers Ministry, and today is August 19th, 2012. And the footage that we're watching is, is live, and pretty much now we're gonna just simply resume from the last place we were. And there's a couple of people we can talk to. I don't know how boring this is gonna be, so if if I skip ahead, you know it was very boring. So let's talk to this guy right here. Always easy to spot a fellow Merc, though you're a little young in the chat. Upgrading equipment, earning money about merchants. How about how do you earn money in this game? The trouble when you young is that you get reckless and you're poor. Fighting in the arena and getting experience might be what you need. If you win matches in the arena, then your fame will spread. Okay. Yeah, sure. How about upgrading equipment? Been out of town yet? A guy called Horace opened a shop near this tavern. He's a bit of an oddball, but his work's good. Why not take a look? Sure. And last but not least, about the merchants, it's tough to survive combat if you're always using the same old stuff. Survival gets easier if you learn to handle different weapons. They're a merchant on the ground floor, take a look. Okay, how about you? Don't stress too much about the different types of equipment. You'll find it's weapons that make the biggest difference in battle. Okay, that's... Usually most RPGs work like that. Greetings, Traveler. Okay. I am a wandering harmonica player. Now that your melody has been added to the islands, what kind of song will play? My melody. Okay. And so here's some doors. Early, early this room. Cyrene and Mariana's room. Hmm. So this is where we live, I guess. Um, whose room is this? Oh, that's my room. Oh, let's go in our let's go to our room. Let's see what's in there. Hello. So we got a cupboard. Wait, this is my room. How come there's four beds? Well, it must be that I'm. Sh this is the room of the guys. The guys' room. And we all stay in there. That must be it. Okay, so this is our pad. Let me go check the girls' room. I'm sure they don't mind. Hopefully, we won't see any bras or anything like that hanging around. They got that. They got a little teapot. Cupboard. Two more cupboards. Let's see what's in. Can I go throughout that door? No, I cannot. Can I go and check in here? <laughs> okay. And she says it says Sirene and Mirana's, is it? I'm not sure who Mirana is yet. We're not sure. And this is Aurelia's room. Who's Aurelia's? We're the main character of this game. Why don't we have our own special room? Oh wait, there's somebody in here. <coughs> What's your name? Mine's Warren. I wanna go outside, but I'm too sick. Okay. It's all that white stuff falling from the sky. That's what made me ill. Snow? You talking about snow, buddy? I don't think he's talking about snow. I mean, I don't know what other white stuff falls from the sky. Maybe well, this maybe the, this game's world doesn't conform to those rules. But whoever that lady is, she whoever Aurelia is, she has her own room. Merchant's room. Oh, that must be the guy that they're talking about. Let's see. Oh, this is this the boss. And this is... Oh, sail. Seems you had something of a hard time of it today. Are you alright? No serious wounds? Um, no. I don't think so, Max. I'm, I'm fine, really. He seems like a nice guy, that's what I would say. say. Wrong. It tends to make me worry even more. Oh, really? Are you a possible love interest? The times when you look the most sure of yourself are when I know you're about to do something reckless. Okay. My mum used to tell me that as well. And she's dead, because she wasn't careful. Oh, I'm sorry. That's really quite insensitive of me. It's okay. You've brought back some happy memories. What, earlier you had a sad memory of your mom telling you to run away. Okay. Can I talk to you a bit more? No, I can't. Okay, how about Cyrene? How about you, girl? Hey, Zael! Have a drink on me! <laughs> wow, Seren. This must be record time. <laughs> okay. That was fast. What, you think I'm drunk? Look, I'm as sober as whatever's normally sober. Anyway, get some alcohol in ya. Okay. I'm a bit lost here. Seren does appear to have become slightly incoherent. <laughs> so she's tipsy. Seren does have a new have comes well I'm saying well. Look. If you're not drinking, then I'll have to get another drink. What? Oh, Zale. While I was at the bar, you turned into a rather handsome chap. Oh, you have beer goggles on you then. Why? What? Why? What? But 
I'll tell you something about handsome chaps, Ayo. Right, being handsome's not enough for him. Okay. They're all shallow chaps, lying chaps, cheating chaps. And if they're handsome on top, I'm supposed to fall for him. Okay. And I know one handsome chap who's all three. Oh, look. There he is. Are you talking about hey, us? About at least you admit I'm handsome. <laughs> See what a horrible flirt he is. Don't you dare turn into that, Zayo. Okay, we, uh, we're, we're honest to goodness, guys. Like her either. <laughs> I'm glad I have so many good role models. <laughs> <laughs> oh wow. Okay. Well, Cyrene, yeah, I, I don't, I don't think that's good for you. But was she hitting on us? Um, I don't know. I'm, I'm kind of dumb about that. I'm not sure. Hey. Okay. Hello. So this is Lowell. Okay, Lowell. It's true. You are the most beautiful woman I have ever laid eyes on. Oh wow, this is a womanizing dude. You've melted my battle-hardened heart. I feel like a new man. Oh man. Do you like man. to order a drink? <laughs> Just being near you fills me with light and magic and joy. Okay. I'll come back when you've decided what you want to drink. Yeah, hey. smart girl. Looks like that one will be a challenge. But I like a challenge. What do you think? Zach? What do you mean, what do I think? I was just say, I think you flirt with every girl. Exactly. My dad gave me some advice before he died. Oh, he really? Said, Son, if you see a beautiful woman, you have to flirt with her. It's rude not to. I think your dad is... It didn't respect women then. My granddad said so too. And the blacksmith next door. Okay, women are not objects, buddy. They're just not things you have sex with. They're not. My dad didn't say that. <laughs> yeah, good. You had a good dad a good then. Thing I'm here. It's the golden rule of being a man. I never break it. Not ever. I don't think the the golden rule is to flirt with them. I think you have other intentions, buddy. So in short, you like flirting. I don't like it. I live it. It's a big responsibility. Being a fine specimen of a man like myself. According to Cyrene. Wait. Does this mean you've even tried flirting with Morania? Of course. What? It's just she didn't even notice I was flirting with her. What about Seren? No, oh, of course we know her. <laughs> well, I only like women. What? What are you trying to say? Ah, watch it, Seren. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. My hand must have slipped. But don't worry. Next time it'll find its mark. <laughs> okay. Well, that's that's interesting. Okay, we're learning about the characters. Let's see about uh, the uh, boss here, Dagron. Dagron, Dagon. I'm not sure You're how. You're showing us all up, Dagron. No, just being paranoid. I've got to keep my sword in top shape. Can't relax otherwise. Well, that's not the sword you were carrying at the stage, or while we were fighting. Make you paranoid. It does make you a bit of a worry, Walt. How long ago did we start up our band of mercenaries? You and me are the only ones still standing from back then. Oh, really? I know. So are we like second in command or something? You know, because of seniority. I hope this doesn't move us forward. I figure we had to talk to this guy last, the Gron. Always important characters, that's what always like triggers new cutscenes in RPG games. Oh whoa. Well. well he's dressed like a knight. Hey, kid. Oh he's really young. You on your own. Same as me then. Oh he's no knight then. Kind of looks well, like it, on. though. Come with me. Okay. And that's how we became our battle-hardened warriors, then. Balancing on the looks edge like of it. a knife. That's how we live our lives. I'm not gonna make you live like this forever, Zayo. I promise you. Okay. The first chance we get, we're moving up in the world. 
Well, we've been trying for a we while, it looks like. In the war. Things that were important to us. But we are our parents, I guess. Back. Yeah. Hmm. You said something the day we decided to become mercenaries. We'll all be knights one day. You'll see. Hmm. I've never forgotten those words. Me neither. And this job could be our break. Count Arganen is very ambitious. Rumor has okay. it he's quietly building up an army, and I don't mean to quell the monsters. If we show him what we can do, that could be us he's recruiting. Okay. We'll do it. Yeah. I'm guessing being a knight would be a steady paycheck. That's probably what they want to become knights, and not have to haggle around being mercenaries. It's a mystery. But that must have been some kind of sacred place you stumbled on. Maybe the guardian angel of Lazarus Island is looking out for you. Maybe. There's a guardian angel? Nope. I just made it up. <laughs> but I do feel like our luck okay. is changing. I hope so, anyway. Okay, then. Well, now that I'm thinking about it, I'm guessing that she must be Mariana. And when it says Mariana in Serene's room. Was it Mariana? I think so. I'm not sure. So the Bard Keep is the last person we need to talk to. Your friends are definitely a rowdy bunch. Wait, I mean, look, we have rooms here. We should... Uh, don't we know each other for so long? <laughs> Sorry. I hope we're not causing a scene. Actually, as mercenaries go, you all seem really nice. Oh, really? My name's Ariella. My dad owns the tavern. You'll be staying here for a while, right? Just ask me if you need anything. Oh, okay. Oh, Thanks. so that's your room on the I'm Zale, top by the way. stairs. Zale? That's a nice name. What do you think of the city so far, Zale? Um, I only just got here, so <laughs> that's true. I think it'll grow on you. If you get the time, you should have a proper wander around. There's tons to see. Okay. Is it always this crowded? Normally, there aren't quite so many people, but it's Lady Callista's wedding soon. Oh, really? Lady who? You don't know? She's the only daughter of the former Count. Okay, so the wedding's big deal. Not for another month, but it's already the talk of the town. Oh, I bet it's going to be such an extravagant wedding. How exciting! How exciting. Yeah, right. I'm not big on weddings, It's to be a whole honest. different world. Nothing like the life of a mercenary. That's very true. Very true, but that kind of how it goes when you're born with a with a spoon in your mouth, with a silver spoon. I see that that see kind of like the the, the seat cursor goes weird on on that place right there. What is that blue stuff? Can't go there. There's nobody else to talk to here, so I guess we should go to the merchant guy. The merchant's room. Let's see. Maybe we can buy stuff now. Seriously. That's it? I was expecting like a little shop mm. or something. I like the look in your eye. Really? You after any Oh pfft. I wanna buy weapons, I do. I'm um, sorry about that, I kinda sk skipped the her whole commentary. So let's see, a blade, um it brings Sarine's regular attack down by twenty, up by ten. I'm guessing Lowell is also a dual wielder kind of guy. I have common case says down in the description and common blade used by many swordsmen, no attributes. Plus three bonus chance of dealing increased damage. Whoa, I'm not sure if, if that's a lot or not. And I currently have two of these. Current two? I'm not sure. Okay. Rogue Edge. So that's it brings our attack a little bit higher. Deals 1.5 slash damage. Okay, so I'm getting my microphone fell off. Okay. Um that must be when you're doing like Downwards attacks, a uh, killer cutter. That wow, that's that brings a lot of. Oh yeah, I, I can't even afford this. That's way too much. And daggers. That's not a good weapon for us to be carrying around. Okay, <laughs> and I see. Yeah, Yurik and Mirana, they can't equip anything. Okay, we don't have any money, so we're just gonna move on. Is there anything we can sell? Okay, so here's some of the stuff that I got from my from my PvP matches and I, they're quite expensive to sell I shouldn't sell any of that stuff because I would be like breaking the game in a sense 
blunt copper sword, <laughs> squeaky hammer, a hammer created by the gods is a plaything of recovering to eight HP when attacking. Okay, is that even a weapon? A flower? You know what? Um, we're not gonna be using those. Just have to live with it, I guess. Okay, I guess so. Let's just move forward. We're not gonna be using those items for our, for ourselves. Let's see what's out oh, there then. Zale, are you heading out? Yeah, the ground. Here's the money we earned today. I'll leave it in your hands. All of it? Okay. We can do with some new gear. After that, you should take a look around the city. I'll see you out there later. Okay. So, buy new gear then. Okay. That's not a whole lot, though. Our mage guy, they, all they do is just simply just cover for them and they do the damage from the background, so backgrounds. So, I guess we should just focus on our, our frontline guys. South of the castle spread Lazarus City. Hub of culture and trade. trade. Okay. Naturally, it drew all manner of visitors from across the empire. Okay. Sailors, merchants, traveling entertainers, and knights errant, and of course, mercenaries. Okay. All were drawn to the city by the lure of fame and fortune. Yet only a lucky few would ever taste the success they longed for. Well, that's kind of how life is. A lot of people come to the United States of America thinking of the same thing. And yeah, not everybody makes it. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sad to say. Okay, so let's see what nearby airborne items to seek. Item will flash us near. Airborne items? What do you mean by airborne items? Can I shoot stuff from the. That's weird. Okay. Another cutscene the central plaza. 